Simon climbs up at 206 from this undisclosed famous arena with a disclosed Troy Van Zandt. I'd like to point out to you, Mr. Van Zandt, I had a bunch of firefighters attack me. Jolly Green Giant, some rod from NXT, and the promoter. I didn't break anything. I know you were scared when you were on Turnbuckle. You were traumatized. I apologize, but nothing's broken. But it, it really hurt. It really hurt, but nothing's broken. You didn't leave in a stretch. That's, that's a good thing. I tried not to disappoint you because I, I hate disappointing bands. That's my you never should for one. But thank you. You did it. I did it. I did it. And you get carried out tonight. Your ankle wasn't hanging off to the side. A busted skull. All my bones are intact. Like they should be. It's a win win situation. Yup. How did you win your match? First one. Well, that's all that counts. Yeah, the first and second, second one didn't matter. It doesn't matter. Second one. Dark one. once. It was a dark match. Went on TV. Well, there you go. Yeah. So I just wanted to point out to you, I kept my promise. I didn't break anything. I know you were traumatized. I don't like traumatizing the band. I will be able to sleep. That's my goal in life. I am able to sleep. Man. Career goal achieved. I did not traumatize you. Unlock achieved. Sleep at night. Troy Van Zandt gonna sleep well tonight. Gonna sleep well. But the Jolly Green Giant, wherever he is, hopefully he doesn't come running around here. You be just walking around, just I don't. You again. What was the deal with the choke slamming? What the was the deal with the interference? What's I, the deal with the Canada I, stuff again? I slipped and fell, and her head happened to be in the ropes. It happens to people. You, what did you do? Did you like have an extra couple grand so you call down to NXT to borrow someone? Listen, last year you were the straight and narrow. We teamed up. We won. This year you started your crap again. Ten star classic Brian Alvarez wept at its greatness. I carried you to that. That's hard to do because you're kind of heavy. But I carried you to a win. And then you burr and you choke slam like you're giant. That's so did she. Who does that? Who brings in a broker and wants to eat choke slam and brown Canadian citizens work out of that? Who does that? Apparently this guy does that. Right here at this world famous arena, which I named, where I'm the Hall of Famer, class of 13. How can you treat a Hall of Famer like that? You don't know how to behave yourself. You couldn't get through more than one year behaving yourself. Behaving myself? Did I choke, slam someone after the match was over, try to break the ribs? If you would have broken my rib, Troy Van Zandt wouldn't be able to sleep. Yeah, they wanted to say it again, too. So Mary joined me. Boom. Is she going to make you cupcakes or something now? Is that the deal? Or is that she she doesn't, well, I know she doesn't bake cupcakes. That's her best friend to make the cupcake. Wow. Well, while I'm at it, I might as well snap. It's going to hurt because, you know, someone choke slammed. They could have broken my ribs, and you could have been the reason Troy Van Zandt didn't sleep for a month. Would you want that on your head? I can take it. I think you seem it. okay. A little sore, maybe. I don't know. So if Troy Van Zandt gets chance maybe he'll take you on because you are fine with him not sleeping that seems a little hard if you say I can't behave myself last I looked they lost the belts tonight no it was a dark match it didn't count uh, huh. he just he just established that mm -hmm. but for the people okay. who love the snaps pamphlet and sign times every show needs a pamphlet you have a pamphlet I have one Facebook YouTube what you might be watching right now Right about now, you might be watching it. You watch me on the YouTube, should. The Twitter where you can follow me, but not literally, because that's creepy stalkers, no offense. Ah, uh, don't even know what goes there. Do you have a Twitter? Yeah. Is it at Toke Slam Innocent Canadian no. Citizens? No. Should be. The Lucha Underground. 
You choke slam people from Lucha Underground. Is that what you do? Do you go down there and you just choke slam them? Not yet. Apparently it's coming. Cauliflower Owl Club program. Have you ever been to the CAC? No. Have you ever wanted to so you can choke slam into some people? I don't choke slam into some people. You did tonight twice. Uh. Comic book team I owe. Have you ever wrestled a boy and his dog? A dog and his boy? No. They do questionable things to the legs of their opponents, just so you're aware. Business card of Casey Carlisle. Hashtag best in the world. I believe he tried to choke slam her. No, I didn't ever get that done. She she got on my back and tried to choke me. But that's been like three and a half years ago, or close to that, almost three years ago. What month of the year was that? That was May of 2013. Late, late in the year, was it? Late in the month? No, it was early. Really? It was actually, you know. As to Casey Carlisle DVD, do you have this? You should. You should I don't. You. I don't. You should have 10, 15, 20 copies. She has autographed pictures for sale. Do you have a few of those? Not of her. Museum quality glass would love this. They would be able to buy new homes. Look at that. She's in a hot nurse's outfit. You don't ever know us, though. And then, what was it this year? Well, she was a baseball player this that's right, year. That's right. Yeah. And yeah, he tried to test me to see if I was okay after that chair shot, which would have killed a normal man. Chair shot from Jerry Wilson, because why not? I was already choke slammed twice. Fireman breaking Canadian arm wrestling rules. Four Lucky years ago, we're four years ago, shaving ball. Don't bring that up. Four years. Four years of hair growth. Eugene has his own show tonight. He's Five states away. Look at that. Look at that. You, you get a pillow next time. Choke slam me on a pillow like that. There she is in smaller form in case you're a midget. You ever choke slam a midget? No. Wouldn't shock me if you did. Look at that. There she is when she was in hot nurse shoe. There she is with a large title belt. I should have brought my picture collection. The museum quality glass people would have to pay to get that kind of notoriety on this show. Look at that, there she is angry, angry that someone tried to choke slam her. There she is with Team Bad Knees. All of them Bad Knees, all of them on different shows tonight because there's 18 shows in the state of Indiana tonight. And there's Seymour Scott, proud member of the Dowd roster. Have you ever wrestled for Dowd? Did you ever choke slam Juan Jeremy? you ever choke slam Count Rogg and anything like that? No. Well, if they were innocent people from Canada, I bet you would. Who does that? Well, this week, I, I'm a busy man this week. You know who's on Turnbuckle tomorrow? I have no clue. Ronnie Angel, the greaser. Then I, I'm going to be like in Jeffersonville, I'm headed down to Jeffersonville. That's like north of Louisville in the in the Bills section. I've been down there several times. Was it, say, a month after April? Many times. Many months. Really? Tuesday. You know what I'm doing Tuesday? I don't know. Nothing wrong. Yeah, I'm pretty much free. <laughs> Wednesday, there may be, like, live, all people in the same place, total dudes. I know you love the total dudes. I know you live for it. Thursday, yeah, pretty much free. Friday. Missy Sampson on the Side Guys Wrestling Show. Are you familiar with her? Who is it? Missy Sampson. I've heard the name. You getting choke slammer? Nope. Well, I hope not. No choke slam one woman. Really? Why would you choke slam a poor defense? Cameron Starr. Cameron Starr. That was that was like uh, four near it was three and a half years ago. Yeah. Wow. I can't believe that he choke slams abroad. Poor defenseless broad. He just Rrr. who does that? People wanted it. Well, if the people wanted to have you jump off the top of the building and do a triple somersault into a leg drop. Would you do it? Now they know better. Because <laughs> I would pay to see that. I would run from the dressing room, hand the promoter the cash, and run back to catch it before you land it. Especially if you yell, early May! Ah. Well, pretty much episode 206 from this famous, famous, famous arena, which I mean, next to it. Very disclosed, very busy, people. 
where Troy Van Zandt will sleep soundly tonight because I am intact despite the best efforts of some people. Some people.